Power and Green have taken on an alternate meaning here at Pocono Raceway. That's the Speedway's new solar farm located outside the short chute between turns two and three. Friday, the Speedway held a ribbon cutting and a formal unveiling. It's going green without waving a flag. The sun is free, it's clean, it comes up every morning, it goes down every night. We make power from, from sunlight here. Uh, we convert solar energy into electricity. It's like you're taking a plug and actually plugging into the sun 93 million miles away. This solar farm is the first of its kind to uh, completely power a, a sports arena. We'll be running everything from our RV lots, all of our scoreboards, our lighting. Every drop of power that we use at the track is going to come from here. Obviously, the, the cars going around the track is very exciting, but they're burning hydrocarbons. They're burning gasoline. This system here is going to be offsetting a lot of greenhouse gases. The Pocono Raceway is really showing the rest of the sporting world how can we go green. She's got a solar-powered light. There's 39,960 panels here on the 25 acres that this farm uh, sits on right now. We've been working on this project for two and a half years. The solar farm cost approximately $16 million to build and construct. The track has been using maybe 1.2 million kilowatt hours per year, and this system is probably going to produce at least three times that. So a lot of people ask what happens to the excess solar energy if the racetrack's not using it. The extra energy that we produce will be uh, supplied back to the grid, and uh, from there it'll get used by the local neighbors. This project is great for a number of reasons. Most of the material has come from the United States. So the panels are made in Perrysburg, Ohio. The lumber that you see is from Oregon. The metal that you see is from California. Why wouldn't we use it all from the United States? Uh, it's an American project. We're here for America. It's American sport. Uh, keep it all American. It's, it's what we need to do here. And it also employed a lot of local labor. It was uh, an opportunity for me to take some guys that um, weren't working and were laid off at the time and, and give them work. The economy has hit us hard, especially in construction. So having a project for 50 of those construction workers to work on every day for two months is a big impact on our economy. We need to look and start doing different things uh, to generate more renewable energy here in America. And if we can lead the brigade here uh, in the sports world, then we're going to do that. Pocono Raceway, we're going green. Thank so much more. And yes, even on an overcast day, those solar panels are feeling the rays of the sun through the clouds and making electricity just not as great a rate, at as great a rate as they might on an ideal day.